Hello, my peepers. Welcome to Shalene's Creativity Room. It is Tuesday, June 28th. What's going on today? Okay, we have no birthday today. Let's see, wisdom quote. Very little is needed to make a happy life. It is all within yourself, in your way of thinking, by Marcus Aurelius. Very little is needed to make A happy life. It is all within yourself in your way of thinking. Marcus Aurelius. Okay. Then we have the word of the day. Word, word, word of the day. Word, 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 word of the day. Open handed. Open handed. Me, it's an adjective. The first definition is generous, liberal, and two is delivered with an open hand as a blow. You know, like a slap. Okay, generous. That's I've never heard of it as generous or liberal. I've just heard of it as d delivered with an open hand. With an open hand, there, there is that. Okay. Have this. Do, do, do. Okay. Today is the weather. Today's the weather says 73, partly cloudy. Right now it's sunny, humidity 55%. And my phone just froze. Okay, when does it, yeah, see, it shows it's going to be cloudy until like 1 p.m. and then the sun will come out. So, yeah, it is partly. So, I can't do mixed because it's not going to rain. So, we can do, let's see, we have a cloud. Cloud and the sun. Well, let's do this here. This is what we're going to do first. We 
we have sun. Where did I put the cloud? It's still here. And then the cloud. Cloud. So, yeah. I like that. I still have a little bit of orange on that. Okay, and today is National Day. Do do do, there it is. National Alaska Day. National Alaska Day. There we go. Okay. Project Planner. Okay, we did not watch any videos yesterday. I did work on Rovera's Halloween. That's what I cross-stitched on. I got in three hours. Three hours of stitching. Um, made my... Today we are doing... Morning video. Morning video. Today is a live color and chat. And then starting next week, they will be the color, color along with me's where I will tell you what we're, what, um, what colors I'm using. Let's see, so I did that. Today we are working, we are stitching. I don't know why I say you're working. We are stitching on um, the Hey the Magic Study reading. Reading wise. I started Harmony of Fire by Brian Feehan. I have, what, two and a half hours left on it, I think. It's okay. Um, so far, it's just like a three star for me. But we'll see. It might get better. Might get better. My reviews all go up today of what, six books? Okay, how did we do yesterday? I went to Hobby Lobby, I did the dishes, restarted my phone, and I wrote the book reviews. I did not change the wax melts. And I didn't vacuum. I did watch the Hallmark movie. I started Harmony of Fire by Brian Fian, And I cross-stitched on Rovera's Halloween. So let's see how we are doing today. Let's see. Okay. 
Okay, I don't need these. Okay, TV. Okay, I have what I want. Today is Tuesday. Do any of these have Tuesday, Thursday? Yep, Tuesday. This one doesn't have any days on it. Huh. Okay. This one has Tuesday. You've got mail. Then Thursday, then Sunday, and then we get to start over with some newer sheets. Okay, so the first thing I do is let's cover these up. Okay, let's see, today we want to do different colors, yeah, let's do these colors. Do, 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 we got lots to do today. Um, do the top three. Put that there. Do we want one of these lawn ones? How about this one? Do we want that one? Um, Take this page out and no, no. Do we need any more? Those done. Um, no, that's not what I wanted to do. That's not what I wanted to do. There. Do, 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 do. Okay. Um, yeah. How about another one of these? Okay. Now let's decorate it. Oh, boy. Bye. Ay, ay. We've got some purples and some greens.
What do you think? Purples and greens. Here's another green. How about another purple? Oh. Another purple. Yep, up. Okay, so we decorated it up. And wax melts. We may do, um, we may vacuum today. Vacuum. I have a couple dishes from dinner last night. Okay, um, zooms. So today I want to zoom, cross stitch, read, um, live, TV, and zoom. Okay, so TV is general. Well, I was going to do that there. Huh. Oh, let's do this. Watch. General Hospital. Because I know what I need to watch. Okay, and then we're reading Harmony of Fire. Let's finish. Brian Feehan. And Cross Stitch. Heed. Magic study. Um, to do. And there we have it. There we have it. I am loving doing the plan like this. I am using up stickers. So we've been doing this since the beginning of June. Look at that. We are using up all the stickers. It has been really nice. Yep, using up stickers.
I really like the flamingo page. And of course my butterflies because I love butterflies. Just love my butterflies. And now we're on to cats. Yeah. And then we go in here. Let's put this on. Oh my gosh. Okay. So yeah, today's live color color and chat. We're working on Harmony of Fire and then um General Hospitals we need to watch 624 628 So I did watch two tickets to paradise yesterday that was on the hallmark movies from saturday night oh my gosh that was so good so yeah that's my goal for today yesterday i went to hobby lobby i got the floss i needed i have a piece of coffee ground in there It's so good. Um, yeah, we went. That's the only place we went to. I had to get gas first, and then gas. Now, when I used to have a quarter tank of gas, and I would fill it, it would be like twenty five dollars. Yeah, what I pay yesterday. I said fill it. It was on a quarter of a tank, and it was $45. What? Really? $45 for gas to fill my tank? I about died. I'm like, really? <sighs> Whatever. I have a little car. I don't have a big tank. Yeah, $45. Oh, the crap. Anyways. So then we had a dog lobby. I spent $40. I had like, I either had 45 or 65 in my wallet for craft budget. And I needed a bunch of floss. And I bought two of the floss storage boxes, one for the two kits that were called um, for Whipco. I needed to kit those up. I do still need beads and some Krynik, but I'm going to go through. I have the list, and I need to go through what I already own to see if I already have them. And I wanted to get, you know, okay, I'm going to gripe. I'm sure some of you also feel the same way. It's not even July. Not even July. And when I went to Target the other day, all of their summer stuff was gone. Their summer furniture, their, you know, the kids' toys, all that stuff was gone. All the fucking school supplies were out again. All of them. It's not even July 1st. We don't need the school supplies till August 1st. Not here in New York. They don't go back to school till after Labor Day. I want a table to put out on my front porch next to my glider. Nope. They don't have shit at Target. Everything's pulled. I'm going to gripe to my son. I know he can't control it, but come on. Next, they'll be selling the you'll you they'll be selling sweatpants and winter coats in July. I'm like, give me a break. And where was the July Fourth decorations? I didn't see any of those out. Oh my gosh! So I go to Hobby Lobby. Target. It was Sunday. I go to Hobby Lobby and they have stuff all out. They're not way ahead. Cool. 
I get my floss, I get my my uh, boxes. I wanted a book of stickers of dates. I didn't realize that the book I bought was 50% off. I would have bought two of them because it's only got one year's worth. Yeah, I would have bought two. Anyways, I got those. And then I said, well, let's see. They had some summer stuff out. So we went through the summer stuff. And they had the bucket and, or what you call a, a pail for the sand. And the little shovels and all kinds of toys for the boys for us to go out on the beach. So I got those. And those were 50% off. And then I got the boys the, these uh, suckers. I, you know, the gourmet suckers. So Carson got four, and Blake got four, and I don't see Blake's. Oh, there they are. And Blake got four. So they get one a day this week. Those are 69 cents a piece. I need to get just a bag of suckers. They like candy, so I don't give them much candy. It's once in a while. So I got those. So yeah, I spent $40. I only planned on spending 20 but that's okay. So, hopefully I get paid next month from YouTube. The last time I checked, I needed to make like $2 more before I get paid from them. And then I will, I don't know what I'm going to do. Probably stick it in my wallet. I'll pull it out from the bank and stick it in my wallet. Hmm, because that's my cross-stitch budget. Yeah. <laughs> Came home and watched Two Tickets to Paradise from Hallmark and bobbinated all the floss I got, got the two projects kitted up. They are ready to go. And what else? And then I sat in here and started cross-stitching on Rovera's Halloween and started my book, Harmony of Fire. And then after dinner, I put it on text-to-speech so I could listen to it while cross-stitching. So yeah, three hours of stitching time in and listening to the book. That was good. Um, so today I hope... I can finish the book and what's next I don't know so you know this is my what am I working on today so yeah hey the magic study and tomorrow is the cauldron and bubble and then the owl beaded kit on Thursday and then July I have some things written down Supernatural, we get a new one on Friday. So I will stitch on that from morning until it's done. And then we will move on to Anna, which is my first Whipco number that was pulled. So I can't fill in any more until I write down how many days I worked on Anna. And then the next one, my next Whipco number was Fairy Roses. I will work on that. So it's either work on a quarter of it or five days, whatever comes first. And then I can fill in the rest of the days and what I'm working on. Supernatural will always be a Friday. It, um, yeah, Supernatural. This day, I don't know how much of it I will get done. The 8th is really busy for me. I have a doctor's appointment in the morning. I have my salon appointment in the afternoon, and I'll probably be going out in the evening because my classmate that got a hold of us said she's out, and we're getting together on the 7th at 6.30 p.m., and she says, and then we'll go from there for the weekend, so... This is my readathon weekend. It's pretty much going to be blown. <laughs> Just how it is. I don't, as of right now, I don't have plans for July 4th. 
that may change. Yeah. Okay, so there's that. But I will let you guys go. I'm going to go check on the boys. They were sleeping. They let me sleep in today. They were not noisy. I'm going to go check, see if they are awake. And um, I'm going to have breakfast and get going for the day. I need a shower. So I'll do that after I have breakfast. I'll eat, take my shower and I'll see if they want to go to the library, get some books out from the library, maybe go to story time. Other than that, sitting in here listening to my book and cross-stitching. I will chat with you all later. You all have a great day. Love you guys. Bye-bye.